Hey, how's it going everyone? Welcome to another Skyrim Special Edition guide. In today's video, I'll be showing you a mod that's called Display Enemy Level. And this mod will allow you to see the level of your enemies, the ones that you encounter, and also their hit points, which can be very useful. Especially in the beginning of the game, when you're likely to encounter enemies that are often out-leveling you. And this mod comes with a couple of different options. It has a configuration file, which you can edit if you want to. I don't think it's necessary, because it works straight out of the box. You can use it on its own, you don't need any other mods for it. But basically, I'm not able to really showcase this because I'm also using another mod that's called High Level Enemies. And I happen to be a very high level myself right now, level 81. So High Level Enemies simply upscales the enemy level to follow your own level and it also adds a bunch of new enemies to the game. But if I didn't have this and I encountered an enemy that I out leveled by 10 levels or more, then their level will be recolored to green which is a nice little indicator that the enemy should be easy to, to kill. Now, if the enemy outlevels you by 10 levels or more, which happens especially in the beginning of the game, if you simply encounter some zones where there are higher level enemies, then their color will be red. So that's a nice little indicator that you should run. So that's what display enemy level does, as well as high level enemies. Now, another mod that I use is called customizable UI replacer, which I didn't really plan to showcase, but I think it's worth mentioning because I think it's a phenomenal mod. And this is a simple retexture mod which allows you to change the way Skyrim looks and make it look like some other game. So for example I'm using the ESO Dark preset, Elder Scrolls Online, because I used to play that for many years. And there are other ones like for example Dark Souls or custom Dragonborn presets and things like that. And other than that I'm also using Sovngarde, a Nordic font, font replacer. This will replace all the text in the game and basically improve the way your game looks. So don't forget to install SKSC, SkyUI and all of the other essential mods. So that's it for this quick little tutorial. If you don't know how to mod Skyrim, there's a video in the description that will teach you how to do it. This is very easy to install and all the links to all the mods that I mentioned will be down below as well. So if you enjoyed this video, subscribe, check out the playlist and I'll see you guys in the next one.